Clark with head coach Kathy Raley. Coach, I- I'm not going to try to say that you guys play poorly in the first half, but between the first half and the second half, what clicked, what changed? You guys look like an almost completely different team in that second half. You know, we, we came out really flat and, and not uh, working hard offensively, I thought. Um, defensively, we weren't executing the game plan. I think at halftime, excuse me, I think at halftime, we really worked very hard at um, trying to explain, like th- we had practiced two days on exactly what we wanted to do. We weren't executing in the first two quarters what we wanted to do. And you know what? They took that halftime and they went out and they were a different team in the second half. Um, and, you know, I, I look at it as the first quarter I could, could write off. I could see us getting better in the second quarter. Okay. And then as we went on, it just got better and better. Um, you know, I'm just I'm really happy at how hard we're working. I'm really happy at the energy that we're bringing to practice and to games. Um, after the first quarter, we had zero doubt we were going to win that wow. game, and wow. and it was not it was never a oh no we better catch up. It was more we're going to catch up, which is a different mindset than we've had in some years past. So um, you know I think the attitude and the energy of this team is going to win them the close ones, which is just exciting. I mean that's that's two Thanks. super exciting wins. Um, I'm definitely going to need to start carrying an AED on the sideline. <laughs> If you see me with a briefcase, that's what's in there, because um, they they are just one goal games are fun though for us. We, lo- we as long as you guys win them, they're fun for us. Glenn, my watch went off as if I was working out. Like like my pulse, the pulse, it just said, you know, great job, you hit a goal. No, I'm standing here watching a lacrosse game. <laughs> uh, you had a bunch of different goal scorers in the second half, but for Katie to be the one to score the game winner and everything about the play obviously was tremendous. Caroline gets all the attention, mm-hmm. the movement was tremendous. But what does that mean for you? For someone that that you know doesn't maybe get that type of shine to be yeah. the player to score in that moment the game winning goal so you, I, I really do think that you know you're a good team when the people on the bench are, are doing the game winners or the people on the bench are changing the vibe of the game or the flow of the game and everyone is so excited for that person mm-hmm. including the person they're on for is super excited. That's how you know you've got a great team. Mm-hmm. So um, I'm so happy for Katie. Katie is super sly, has a great ID, uh, IQ, and knows where to be. Um, you know, she's she's uh, had some injuries, and her coming back full strength is something that we're we're absolutely cannot wait for that to happen. And today really showed that she uh, has what it takes to get out there and pop a goal. And not only not only that, but the game winner. Yeah. So um, it's just great when you can do that. When you can go 17, 18 players deep, and they're all doing something exceptional. Uh, that makes us hard to scout, and that makes us hard to defend. You know, we're going to talk to both Kara and Caitlin, but specifically Caitlin and the draws tonight. I mean, my word, what that did for your team to constantly be snagging them, getting big ones throughout the course of the game, and then obviously she had a huge goal down there late. Can you put into words, doing everything tonight, how important it was? You know, during the game today, and and she's always been very good at the draw. Um What I saw today that is extremely different and I'm so proud of and I just wanted to run out there and give her a hug during the (laughs) actual game, she she drew one up and it was a battle for the ground ball. I mean, it was not as if she was a step closer and just had to run through and get it. It was a battle. She had such grit and and determination that that draw was going to be hers that I like teared up on the sideline. (laughs) But I was so proud of that because She's always been very good at controlling where it goes and, and, and snagging it out of the air. But she's grown from that girl to the one who is just not going to lose possession. If she's in it, she's going to come up with it. And it was, that was one of the most proud moments I had in today's game. I was just, it, it was just fantastic to see that. You could see the determination on her face. I hope Sabina got a picture of it. That's awesome. That is awesome. All right. Uh, enjoy the warmer you. weather. You get away Thank from you. what we're going to be dealing with the next couple. Oh, of my days. goodness. I know. Thank you so much. Uh, great win. Thanks. Obviously, what a turn. Thank you, Kathy. Appreciate it.